Hey guys, so what I have here is the black bear that I harvested in the fall. Um, this guy, you know, along with a lot of other uh, wild game has been uh, feeding me for about six months. Um, but now it's time to, you know, get the hide out and uh, get it prepared. So what I want to do is build a log stretcher, kind of like an old school frame to stretch the hide on and uh, that'll allow me to scrape it and dry it out and get it ready to tan and eventually make something with it. So right now this thing's frozen solid. Uh, it's going to be a day or two before I can actually work with it. But today I'm going to go out and get the logs and uh, build the stretcher. the snowshoe. I think it's just about lunchtime here. Gonna make some uh, spruce grouse noodle soup and uh, some coffee, and we'll get back at it. This is not for you. quick little uh, little meal here really saved the day in the fall when I was out and I, I shot some footage for that uh, fall trapping out of my canoe video there uh, I got extremely ill way out in the back country uh, with the regular flu and uh, Nanook and I managed to flush a couple grouse like this. I had some noodles with me and uh, we made a nice spicy uh, chicken noodle soup. Bush chicken. The logs we grabbed before were a little rotten, so I went out and hunted down some uh, uh, dead standing jack pine. A lot better wood here, it'll last. I plan on uh, using the stretcher for a long time, so. So you're starting to feel like spring. Uh, probably about there.
So now that the hide is uh, all thawed out, uh, I can start to get ready to flesh it. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is uh, remove the paws and uh, I'm going to freeze these again. Um, so I've got another use for uh, these. I want to do something with the claws. So. What I'm doing right now is just trying to get as much of the flesh and membrane off as I can. I don't want to work it too much because uh, I've got a couple things working against me. Actually three things. First this is my first bear that I've ever done. Secondly, um, it's a young bear. He's about 200 pounds, um, so his skin's already fairly thin. And thirdly, um, I got him in the fall, in the early fall, September. So uh, as the winter goes on, as the seasons change, their uh, hide thickens and it's a lot easier to uh, flesh a nice thick hide. going to salt this up and then fold it in half onto itself for about an hour. What I'm doing now is just putting some holes to tie the, the hide up with. I'll add a few more of these after, but I uh, just need to get a few initial uh, a few initial holes done to get it started. Well, it's shaping up pretty good here. It looks like I'm going to be working into the night. Um, I've got to add a lot more tie-out points. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. It always feels good to be doing this kind of stuff and, and learning new things out here. So, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to the finished product and uh, seeing what I can make with this. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, happy trails.